Rehoboth town, though falling outside the Comas region, is also under lockdown and residents are expected to stay at home or only move around when it is absolutely necessary. But being it a payday, our visit to the town centre was met with business as usual scene and visibility of law enforcement agencies was also poor. Classified non-essential were however closed. Others such as supermarkets and banks continue to operate at least with tight hygiene rules. Spacing in queues and sanitizing of the shopping carts are just some observed at the shops on the famous Church Street and the Rehoboth Mall. This is a communal activity and we have to help each other against this virus. Adherence to the preventative measures of the state of emergency is a challenge. I have asthma and can't keep the mask on for a longer period. It makes breathing difficult, but I will get the gloves from the shop. This security guard at the First National Bank ATM had a hard time in getting the customers to adhere to the rule of the one-meter spacing. People do not want to listen to me and I am alone here trying to control them. It is really difficult. Many residents are attributing the little to non adherence to lack of intense awareness on COVID-19 at the town. They are accusing the local political and community leaders for not doing enough to convey government's message to the residents. Please convey the message to our government. It's a really a big problem. I and I don't know the consequences that we will suffer if this thing is, is spreading like wildfire. The residents also want necessities such as gloves, hand sanitizers and masks for free, especially for the elderly. Now it seems to me like a, it is something that is only meant for people who have money. And now also it, it seems like where, for example, uh, a mask was bought in Ventuk at the suppliers for five dollars. Now the, now the guys in Ventuk, the business people, they are saying they have to buy it now for eighty dollars. Where are they getting it? In the shop there. Which shop? For free, for Which, which shop? That one there. Since for free. When? Since when? Since Sunday. Uh -uh. Apart from the busy buzz of the payday chronicles in the town center, residential streets were relatively quiet. Those who opted to stay at home told us that they were aware of the rules of the state of emergency, but called on the law enforcement agencies to increase patrols. Hardab Regional Governor Esmi Isaac says her office has set up a task and mobilizing teams to spread the information, calling on constituency councillors to take the lead. Isaacs called on the police to find those not adhering to the state of emergency regulations. Blanche Correses, NBC News, Rehoboth.